Hypnosis to Change Your Life with Dr. Steve G. Jones. The question is, do I recommend NLP and timeline therapy uh, for pre-hypnosis or how would I apply this? Well, we've got a few words here now. We've got NLP, which is Neuro Linguistic Programming. NLP is neuro linguistic program. It's a huge body of, of knowledge. It would take me, it took me 30 hours to explain it to my students in the 30 hours of videos they get. So it's, it would take a long time to explain everything in it. Uh, we can boil NLP down to saying it's uh, helping people make new associations that are more powerful. Uh, and then we've got timeline therapy. Uh, we'll call it TLT. I don't think anyone ever calls it TLT, but we'll call it that. Uh, timeline therapy, uh, which is having someone, it says a lot of things, but one of the ways you use timeline therapy is by imagining your life as a timeline. Uh, you are here and you can go back in the past and you can hover over the timeline and see yourself doing certain things and, and make some quote unquote changes in the past. You can go into the future and see what it would look like. Uh, if you keep keep doing the same thing you're doing now, keep smoking, you see, you'll see what's going to happen in the future. Stop smoking, you'll see what's going to happen in the future. That's the essence of timeline therapy. So the question was, do I use these things as part of uh, pre-hypnosis, you know, like before hypnosis, do I do these things, or how do I use them? Well, I'm primarily a hypnotherapist. So when I see a client, uh, we start with, uh, I'll just call it H. Uh, we start with hypnosis. So, you know, right from the, the get-go, when I'm working with them, I'm, I'm using hypnosis. Uh, it may turn out that in the hypnosis session, I need to use a little timeline therapy. I may need to have them imagine themselves going back in time or going future, future and, you know, ahead in time to see what's going to happen. But I usually do that within the hypno hypnotherapy session. Someone who just does timeline therapy or NLP wouldn't probably do that. They would probably just use it out of hypnosis, which is fine also. Uh, NLP, I use outside of hypnosis. I use NLP if, if hypnosis is not working to get the results that I want. I, I use NLP as a, as a backup. So that's how I apply everything. But I, I start with a hypnosis. So when a person asked if I use these uh, pre-hypnotically before hypnosis, I do not. I start with hypnosis. I, I may add uh, a timeline therapy in. I may even have some, NL, some minor NLP during the hypnosis session, but I'll usually use NLP as a backup if hypnosis isn't working. That's just my preference because I'm primarily a hypnotherapist, but that's not, the, that's not the right or the wrong way. That's just my way. Hypnosis to change your life with Dr. Steve G. Jones.